How's it going? Here's a uh, update on the Evo. I uh, scraped the mesh off the glass here, like I said I was gonna do. Did that all the way around. I originally tried using my uh, Seachem scraper, which the blades are pretty sharp, but not quite as sharp as a regular razor blade from the hardware store. So got one of those, it made a huge difference. But I just made sure the, the glass was wet and I found scraping from the bottom up was easier, which since this tank is already set up, the backside was a little, a little harder to do. It took a little bit more time, but I mean, all in all, it, it was super easy. So if you're thinking about doing that, you're not gonna scratch it, you know. I just kept the glass wet to be safe, you know. Moved some corals around again. But uh, I took this stock section, this section of the lid, and actually dremeled out this piece here to put this new bracket on. I had a gooseneck hanging off, off the back and you know up this way but uh so that looks pretty good try that height i think that's at about nine and a half inches or so and notched this piece out here for um the little bracket that holds the tubing on for my auto top off but uh i think it looks pretty good i mean we'll see if i get sick of it i don't really like the um little bit of overhang there I can I can zip these off too but um, I know there's a company that does uh, 3d printing the same company that makes this here was it 3d reefing I think yeah they make I think they make this section that goes over the uh, the uh, things there. Bear with me. Um, but I don't know. We'll see. Looks looks pretty good for what it is. So uh, that's it.